hesitation. I, nah, there's no basis. I know these be hating, but that's what made me feel like in the real life, dreaming all the sauce in the good life. You shine, I shine, and ain't nobody gonna take my From the site that many call the loudest in the NFL, we are inside Arrowhead Stadium here in Kansas City. The scene just a few moments ago, predictably loud and raucous here at Arrowhead as their beloved Chiefs took field, and they are set to match up with the Baltimore Ravens. Justin Tucker set to boom this one away. And we are underway from Arrowhead. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. now on first down and this one caught by Travis Kelsey still staying on his feet are you serious and a nice gain of 21 yards and that tight end position it just seems to continue to evolve every year in the NFL yeah you're getting really terrific athletes a lot of them maybe were wide receivers at one point they continue to give you speed, great hands, and big bodies, which make them excellent targets for quarterbacks. To throw, it's Mahomes. Complete the tight end, Kelsey. And taking it across midfield and inside the 45. The Chiefs have got the passing game rolling a bit. And another first down. Back-to-back -back good plays have them on the move on first down. Throwing on first down is Mahomes. This is complete to Watkins on the slam. And they'll be inside the 35 now at the 34-yard line. Give him nine there on the first down completion. One thing we do know, he's going to get his catches. So as they move forward defensively, got to continue to focus on not giving up the big play when he does catch the ball in the secondary. It down to the 32. Only a gain of a yard, but that's all they needed is that's going to move the chains. Second and one, and people want to run the football. This is where every back in the league is supposed to do exactly what we just saw there. Pick up the first down. From the 32 now, here's first and 10. Here's a carry for the fullback. That's Anthony Sherman. And he's going to fight his way forward here for a modest gain. Give him five on the carry there, and it'll be second down. And there's the pickup you want on first down. All offenses say, you get me four on first down, we'll take it. How about if you get five? They'll really be happy. On the run, it's Ware. Ware breaking the tackle, and they'll have it in the red zone before he crosses over out of bounds. An 11-yard pickup, and it's enough for a Chiefs first down. Quite the opening drive march they're on right now. It looks a lot like what we saw in practice prior to the game, doesn't it? You know, because on that last big practice beforehand, you go through your offensive script. You go through your play calling. You go through all the stuff and establish things. And it looks like it's going like clockwork right now for them. He's going to get this one out to his fullback. And he's able to work it here to the eight-yard line. It'll be a gain of eight yards, and it'll make it second down. I don't think it's a surprise they're throwing the football early. We expected that. They told us they were going to come out firing, but four for four on the opening drive. They like that. <laughs> they don't just like it. They love it because now 
Everyone gets locked in. Your confidence jumps up. Everyone's easy about what they're doing out there. And by the way, they're looking at the sideline thinking to themselves and expressing. Let's keep going. We're doing pretty well. And he'll be brought down this time at the five-yard line. Mahomes to the former Ram, Sammy Watkins for the Kansas City first. point counterpoint it they decide to throw for it on first and goal instead the defense counters with pressure and the defense wins getting a big sack it's second and goal but now all the way back at the 14 here we go now green 39 green 39 Back now with Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon as the Chiefs in possession of the football as we begin the second quarter. And they'll come up looking to keep this drive moving. Second and 14 as they've got work to do here after the sack. Working from the gun, Mahomes under pressure again, and down he goes again. Second goal, last thing you need to do is get pushed backwards to take a sack, but he couldn't find anywhere to go with the football, had to eat it, and ended up on the ground. Going to need better protection here. Third and long following the sack for Mahomes and company. From the gun, it's Mahomes. He dropped it. Couldn't hang on in the end zone. So no six points incomplete. Let's give this defense some credit now. They let the guys get downfield. But when push came to shove, they stood their ground. Now they'll likely force a field goal attempt. And that is no good. And this will remain a scoreless game. Well, this winds up an empty possession. Everything looked okay. He just never got the ball on target. And knowing him, he'll be disappointed with that effort. Jackson and the Ravens come up now first and 10 at their own 28-yard line. They'll throw on first down with Jackson. It's complete to Brown, right side. And he'll be brought down right at the 30 here. To give him a couple on the catch, it's second and eight. Under four to go now as the clock runs and they come up on second down. On second down, Jackson. He's got his man on the crossing route. And getting this chest shy of midfield, they'll spot it at the 49. First target, first catch at a first down. Jackson on first down, buying time to his left. Looking left side, and he's got a man. It's Edwards. And they'll wind up getting this one all the way down inside the 20. A gain of 32 that time. So the big play means just like that, they'll operate from the red zone now on first down. From the red zone now, here's Jackson on first down. Flushed out right. That is caught inside the five. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Ravens touchdown. A great play there from 19 yards away. And the Ravens are in for six. Here's Tucker now out to kick this one away. Fielded about a yard deep. And a nice return sets him up pretty good. Hit the third step of the missed field goal. And that can hurt the psyche of a team because as they drove downfield, you know you're supposed to count points in your mind until they go up the board. 
But let's face it, we've been there. We've seen teams before. They were counting on those points. They didn't get them. A battle for it, and it's intercepted. Picked off here by Jimmy Smith. And they will set up shop at their own 41-yard line. Jackson and the Ravens come up now first and 10 at the 41-yard line. Now a handoff looking right. And he takes it past the 45 and down at the 46. It's a six-yard gain on the ground, and that'll make it second and four. I can't help it. Every time I see Eric Berry make a play, as we just saw him make a tackle there, I just want to stand up large. Because he went to Tennessee like you? Well, that, that doesn't hurt one bit, <laughs> but how about the comeback? I mean, he came yeah. back from, from beating cancer and getting back to Pro Bowl level, one of the best players in the game. Now here's a defensive timeout called by the Chiefs. It's just their first, so they'll have two remaining here before we get to halftime. Second down, here's Jackson. And the hit jarred it loose. It's incomplete. Let's phrase this delicately, okay? Might have had a better option instead of throwing the football into double. He was blanketed. I was surprised that he went his direction. Yeah, should have thought maybe about the check down. Take the completion, keep moving. Now they face a third down and four after that incompletion on second down. Jackson. And incomplete. The contact made the ball roam free and brings up fourth down. Well, those two have hooked up for a touchdown once already in this game, that time unable to find the completion. Yeah, it just appeared they wanted to get him out into open space and try and get him the football. As you mentioned, unable to connect. And this one hits at the one, continues on into the end zone for a touchback. And the Chiefs now getting set to go. And last time, one play interception. So this offense, they should be fresh. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good way of putting it. And I can't wait to see what they decide to do with play calling because a one play drive where you throw an interception, a lot of people think the very next time out, run the football, don't give them a chance. Maybe play action. I think maybe you go play action, show your quarterback, get a little confidence in him, and let him fling another one. Solid way to start the drive. 13 yards, picking up the first. That was a nicely run slant route, and what the receiver's trying to do is make the defender think he's going upfield for a deeper route, and then breaks it off, usually after about three to four steps, and cuts towards the middle of the field, and now what he's trying to do is use his body to keep the defender away from the football and give the quarterback a really nice target. And he'll be brought down right around the 37. That throw good for four. It's second down. Four yards on that last completion, so that sets up second and six. They run it here. Where? And a good swarm to the football defensively as they get him down at about the 40. Two yards the gain there, and now they're left with a third and about four for a first. Here's Mahomes to throw. And this is caught by Watkins. And taking it across midfield and inside the 45. And now we won't see a play on first down. We're going to get a tout instead as they stop it here with just under 40 ticks in this first half. Mahomes now after the pick on the last drive, three for three to start this drive. It's first and ten. Shotgun snap to Mahomes. Into a double team and it's intercepted. Picked off by Tony Jefferson. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. That's sort of a second quarter to forget for him. Now two picks in this frame. Almost if the first one that he threw, he couldn't shake, couldn't get it out of his head. He ends up throwing a second one result. Compounds the mistake a little bit. Yeah, you got to be able to forget, compartmentalize, whatever you want to call it, and move on. He hasn't been able to do so here in the second. Now, before the second down play, we'll get whistles and a timeout as they'll stop it with 27 seconds remaining here in the second quarter. Let's go! Three, 
Now Jackson on second down. And an alley to run. It's a pickup of 11 and a Baltimore first down. Detroit! Detroit! Throwing on first down, it's Jackson. Stepping up, he's going to keep it. Back-to-back 11-yard -back gains, and they've got another first down. Now a timeout taken. Perhaps a chance for one more quick and then another timeout if they hurry. We'll see. Ball up to the 35 as they come up on first and 10. Hurry up, here we go. Now Jackson on first down. And that is incomplete. Two seconds left on the clock. Trying to get it to Willie Sneed there. And that'll bring up second down. Here's second and 10 now from the 35. Final play of the half here. It's Jackson. And his throw is going to be incomplete. That's it for the first half. Two more quarters to go. We'll have plenty more to see after the break. Okay, Coach, appreciate it. A one-touchdown game here as we get set to resume play in the second half. The Ravens ready to receive it, and they've got the lead as well as we resume play in the second half. And this will be a touchback as that sails over the end line. Out come the Ravens now. They'll go on offense first here in this third quarter. We have not seen much on offense from either side. These last few drives, it has been a struggle, hasn't it? Totally, and you're thinking to yourself right now, if you're on offense trying to get things figured out, okay, we self-scout every week in our game plan. How many things do we do at certain times? What are our tendencies? Time to go to some of those tendency breakers and try and create some offense. They always have those in their back pocket, don't they? You have to. And if you don't keep up to what you're doing, you lock into a rhythm and make it easy for the opposition. Looking for tendency breakers right now. So now first and 10 in Chiefs territory at the 47. Throwing is Jackson. It's a pickup of 11 at a Baltimore first down. Ah! On first and 10, it's Jackson eluding the pressure right. They'll tussle for it, and this is going to be caught. Give him 30 yards there. Sometimes it's designed. Sometimes you just have to know when to leave the pocket and move and make something happen. And on that play, he was able to get on the run and was still accurate throwing the football. Here's Jackson to throw. Forced out to his left. He's going to flip one out here to his running back. And they'll be driven back here, losing yardage to the nine. That's going to go as a loss of two, and it'll be second down. Now from the nine, here's second and goal. Here's Jackson. That is caught at the seven-yard line. And he is into the end zone for a Baltimore touchdown. John Brown, a nine-yard touchdown grab. And the Ravens will add on to their lead. Tucker with the extra point, and that'll make the score 14 to zip. Here's Tucker now out to kick this one away. This fielded a few yards into the end zone. And he'll bring it a few past the 20 to the 23rd line three and we'll stay can do and I can't wait to see what have planned because some teams script to start a half other teams just go okay these are the sequence of plays we want to run these things worked well for us and sometimes they throw in that big chunk play right away shot try and get after them early and try and create a big play to give themselves some momentum see what they have up their sleeve 
Now they couldn't get anything going there out on the right side in the flat of the swing pass. And didn't we have a discussion with their staff about wanting to get the backs more involved in the Big passing emphasis. game? Huge emphasis for this game, but obviously the defense had other plans and really made a nice play. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. He'll wind up losing a yard on the play, and that's going to lead to a third 12. This offense in desperate need of a conversion as they come up on third down. Here we go now. Blue 45. Blue 45. They go play action. Now Mahomes. He's going to air one out. And he's going to be intercepted a third time. Picked off by Martin Humphrey. And they are going to take over right there at the 22-yard line. You hear me laughing, partner, and I'm not laughing at the situation. But sometimes you just get yourself into a rut. It's hard to shake yourself out of it. Jack, the Ravens come up now first and 10 at their own 22. Now Jackson. It's caught left side by John Brown. And he's got it past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. The drive starting with a first down, 11 yards on that pickup. That looked like a pretty good route combination there because you've got to find a way to clear the guy running the drag because when you do, you just put the ball on him and then let him run. Yeah, he's got some space. They go play action here on first down. Flush to his right. Now he'll let it go deep right side. It's caught inside the 25. And all the way in for a Ravens touchdown. Willie Sneed, 67 yards, and the Ravens will extend their lead. And remember, partner, that's a rookie quarterback back. Apparently, he's getting the hang of this NFL thing pretty quickly. At three touchdown passes, you're right, he looks comfortable. What are they doing, anything in particular? Well, they keep talking about making sure they're giving him plays that fit his talents, and also maybe shrinking the playbook a little bit. They did tell us that. Bottom line, he's really good. And he'll wind up getting an extra couple yards here for trouble as he'll bring this one out to the 27. And now here comes Kansas City. They're sort of seeing themselves spiral out of control. Let's see if they can get things back on track. And this is where the coach is walking that line of being calm and really being firm with his team. Had one tell me once, you know, when we're having a tough patch. Two shell pass, this two shell pass, and then finally we kept having a rough patch. He said, but you've got to do something <laughs> Heads up. to make it pass. And that's what they have to do. They've got to get some control back, get themselves reasserted, and calm things down. See if they can get calm and reassert themselves here. The tight end, Kelsey, has it over the middle. And they have this across midfield and inside the 45. We're back now in KC. A lot of folks starting to make their way to the parking lot. Their guys trail big here to begin quarter number four. Mahomes now 11 to 15 through the air. Here's first and 10. On play action, it's Mahomes. Oh, he's able to outmuscle him here as he pulls it in. Another nice gain, 16 yards there and a first down again. They were in zone defensively, went with a crossing route. It's always interesting to watch that chess match. Yeah, and I think safeties don't mind crossing routes against zone because eventually you're going to run into their territory, and that's when they lick their chops in order to get the big hit or a play on the ball. Offensively, nice execution to find a hole, make the catch. Dumps that off to Ware, and they take him down, losing yardage back at the 27. It's a loss of a yard there, and now second down. That pass play wound up for negative yardage, so here's second and 11. They go play fake. Mahomes. And he'll be hit as he releases it, and that'll fall incomplete. Tell you what, partner, after he ices down, he's going to be a nice long soak in a hot tub after this one. He's been under duress the entire game. And once again, hit as he throws four. And that one wound up incomplete. The Chiefs on third down. Just one for three thus far. This is third and 11. Hey, 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 hey. Here we go. Green, 90. Mahomes to throw once more. 
He's going to let it go deep for the end zone. And he knocks the ball away, and it falls incomplete. I know he wants to get his team back in the game, but a 50-50 ball right there that makes a little questionable. Yeah, he's pretty lucky to get that one back. I think that sometimes quarterbacks play with a lot of confidence that borders on arrogance, and that can put your team in some dutch. Yeah, especially maybe you want to look at some safer routes after the interception he had that ended their last drive. Now here's Mahomes. And it is in Andy Reid went for it, but it won't pan out.